Hey y'all, today an easier method to season your carbon steel wok in less than five minutes to ensure it remains non-stick and looking almost as good as the day you got it. Seasoning a wok can be very tedious and very, very time consuming. And after months of use, it'll start to scratch off, therefore your food starts sticking. This method ensures that no matter what you cook in this wok, it will not stick and it ensures that your wok remains almost as pretty as the day you got it. We want to start by placing the wok over high heat for about two minutes. You'll notice it starts to turn colors. That's the metal's pores opening up, getting ready to receive the oil. Once the wok starts to barely smoke, add just enough oil to coat the bottom and the sides. Then let that smoke for about 30, 40 seconds. This is when your wok is becoming seasoned. Then add your food, Cook per the recipe and you'll notice it doesn't stick. The better test though is the fried egg test. Put an egg in that wok, let it sit for about 20 seconds. You'll notice that we'll start moving the skillet around and that egg just easily slides around this wok, letting you know that this wok is completely non-stick. After the cook, turn off the heat, let it cool completely. Now you'll notice that this brown stuff you see here, we want to get that off to restore the wok to almost its original bare metal. Then using a scouring pad and dish soap and hot water, we want to scrub all that discoloration and the seasoning off. This will take about five minutes. Then just give it a good rinse, take some paper towels, wipe off any excess water and we want to put it on medium heat on the stove to thoroughly dry. After that, turn off the heat, add a light coat of oil to the inside and outside to prevent any rusting while you store the wok. This is an easy process and doesn't take long at all. And that's how you season a wok in less than five minutes. Thanks so much for stopping by. Leave a comment. I'll answer every one of you. But until next time, as always, bye-bye, y'all.